I'm building a survival shelter for North Survivors. Three, thirty thousand, I mean, thirty thousand uh, subscriber contest. And uh, while I was starting to build the shelter, I saw how dark it got and quickly a uh, quick tarp shelter so that I now uh, can start on a stop that we're ready to build a survival shelter for North Survivals 30,000 subscriber contents. I took that lock which was fallen over there and hanging over took another one dry put it across and right now I am making the roof so at the moment there's already less light coming through now I'm going to take things like this and put them up here so within time there's no more light coming through in order to protect it from water I need to add the debris layer then so this is going to be quite uh, windproof and probably somewhat rainproof so my shelter got ready finished right on time because it just now started to rain as you hear now I can start to work on the bed even in the cover of the shelter already well normally I would have my tarp with me all the time uh, but you asked us for a survival shelter, so this is what I'm coming up. Maybe I'll post you another update in a short clip when I'm done with the bed. I don't know if I can make it because it's already sunset. We will see. These two trees were just lying here, so I notched this one right now here. I notch this one so I can put this here on the side because they are not even now this comes in here I notch this one and I could put uh, another one now there so that the bed is going to be the raised bed is going to be even okay this is my tool for it And in a little bit, I'm going to have my warmed up dinner. Here's the Oberwaldsee. And here the joggers come by. And I don't know. And there is my shelter. On the fallen log. I think you can see it. So it's a tad stealthy. It's here on this earth wall, me coming up, branches, the moss and the debris.
quite a lot of work, but with the coat on and far away from the cold ground and getting reflective heat from the top, I think it would be possible to survive a night here. And uh, it holds me good. So see. No. This, the wind is coming from uh, that direction, west, northwest would be in that direction. So I'm glad I'm finished.